Hey guys, Blanche and Tim here at Jayco Newcastle with one of the schmickest looking RVs you will see on the lot here at Jayco. Uh, Tim, I want you to tell me a little bit about the Fiat Ducato. Firstly, the black decal of this, super sporty, super schmick. Absolutely. We have ordered this in the black cab with the optional black alloy rims. It does make it look like one of the smartest looking motorhomes on the road. Absolutely, got to agree. Pair it with the black awning, it looks super schmick. Uh, not only does it look good, this thing, front wheel drive, which means it drives a little bit like a car, but I want you to talk me through the nine speed gearbox. Mine's got six, so obviously nine, more is better. More is always better. So it is front wheel drive. It is paired with an Alco chassis, so the rear wheels are set outside the front allowing this to go through corners and manoeuvre through city traffic a lot nicer than what those big trucks do. The nine-speed automatic gearbox puts that torque down to the ground, so 450 newton metres of torque, 173 horsepower coming from this. Low gear ratios, easy starts, 2.3 litre turbo, what more could you want? Well, uh, one thing I do want is to be able to tow something behind it. So. I'm going away for the weekend. I want to really load the kids' bikes and everything into a trailer behind it. It's got a great towing capacity as well. Absolutely, so 1,500 kilos, you name it, put it in a trailer, and you're taking your accommodation with you. If I want to tow a car, there's a certain way to tow a car with this type of RV. There, there is, so 1,500 kilos. We do recommend that you flat tow either a manual or you can get some automatics with a disengaging transfer case. One of the, the great technologies that I'm seeing in uh, a lot of the Jayco products to date is the rear view camera when you're driving along. Now, um, when trucks pass us or we pass trucks, we do get that little bit of movement inside the, the RV or the van. Great feature though, uh, for trucks coming out behind you, is the camera the camera systems that we're seeing in these now. That's right, so a dual, dual camera system, you got one pointing straight out, just like you'd look in your rear view camera in your daily driver, and then one, you flick across to that, look straight down at your bumper bar so you can squeeze into those tight spots. We can't go anywhere without fuel. Uh, where does the fuel go in the field? Fuel, as with all of our motorhomes, it is diesel. Open up the passenger side door. And I'm guessing that that little flap there is going to help me out with diesel and AdBlue. Now, what does AdBlue do in today's technology? So, AdBlue is a cool little additive um, available at all service stations now. So, it is it is designed for better fuel economy as well as cleaner exhaust emissions. Okay. So, it is cleaning all that dirty air that you're pumping out the back, so better for the environment. Absolutely, and that's what we want to see. All right, I've heard there's great talk there's great gears, there's lots of technical stuff. Let's have a look what this cab looks like inside because I think judging by the outside, it's gotta be pretty big. Welcome inside the Fiat Ducato. Uh, Tim, when it comes to luxury inside an RV motorhome, I think we have found it. Um, first things first, we spoke about the, the rear facing camera when you're driving. This is uh, amazing technology. Absolutely, so at the moment we've got it on that rear facing mode. To switch down to your bumper bar, V1, V2, straight down. So, so you can now see your tail lights, see right down and reverse nice and close into where yeah, you're Yeah, so if you're in a tight little spot and you want to get the your motorhome in nice and tight, that's really great technology. It, it absolutely is, and, and so easy at the touch of a button. Now speaking of tech, the media center not only looks fantastic inside this Fiat, but the usability, it's really quite functional and quite easy to get through. It is, absolutely. So it is a touch screen, um, and you do have your navigation there, so all powered by TomTom, Tom, so good and reliable maps. It's gonna take you anywhere. If I'm traveling and I wanna use my mobile phone, this is going to basically let me talk to the RV and, 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 and call whoever I want. Absolutely, it is all controlled through your buttons on the steering wheel, so you don't have to touch it. You do get the media function from your phone as well. Bluetooth it in, and you've got all your contacts, all your music at the touch of buttons on your steering wheel. One thing we know here in Australia is it's either really hot or it's really cold. The air conditioning inside the Fiat is second to none. Fully automatic climate control. No more playing with temperatures, playing with buttons, getting that right. Set it to your desired temperature. We've got it on 22 degrees and let it do it itself. I want to stay down here because I've obviously got the 12 volt, we've got the USB connection inside and they're tucked away so they're not going to get any dirt or anything in it. But can you tell me about the, the lane assist and the hill control? 
Absolutely. So if you are going down a, a bit of a steep incline and you want some of that control, this button here just allows the car to do the braking for you. It will use the gearbox, it will use the engine, and it will use the brakes as well. One of the new features we're seeing is this lane assist in most modern cars, and great to have it in this hover vehicle as well. Absolutely. So lane assist, you got two little lights up on the dash. This is new for this model. Um, it, it does tell you if you've got that cruise control set and you're on a longer trip, it allows you to, you, you still got to focus, but if you do tend to drift, it's going to tell you. And one last little button over here is the one with the T on it. It's not going to tell me the time, is it? No, that one's not. That one is increased traction control. So that one allows you to drive on your, your gravel surfaces a little bit more off, off the road, off the beaten track, if you will. So hit that one and, and it will allow a little bit more slip than usual um, through an electronically controlled diff through to the front wheels via that nine-speed automatic. Speaking of nine-speed automatic, uh, nice little schmick little gear changer in there. And it's got this uh, function called drive mode. It does, so this is brand new and this is very exciting, the nine-speed transmission. Not only does it reduce your fuel economy, it's lighter, it's more reliable, but it allows you to select different drive modes. So just there, we've got a mode button. It will allow you to select a power mode, an eco mode, or for normal driving, normal. Great little function inside the fit. Now, uh, just taking a look at the full leather steering wheel that you've got there. So if you've got those big long trips, you know there's nothing worse than trying to hang onto a steering wheel that's just not comfortable. Inside the Fiat Ducato, this looks and feels super comfortable with all the devices that you need at your fingertips. It is, so brand new, again for this model, full leather. Um, as you touched on, you've got all your functions there for telephone, you've got your cruise control down here. Now, being a European vehicle, you do have the blinkers on the opposite side, so you are excused for, for bumping the wipers every now and then, getting from your, from your daily if, if it was a Japanese, but you'll only do it a few times, and then you'll be, be into it. Also, uh, just want to touch on this, because it's great. I am actually swiveling inside the chair, inside the cab. What that does, it just opens up so much more room. You don't just have the front-facing seats. We can spin around and actually have more people inside the, the overall. It is. It, it turns your cab into part of the rest of the, the motorhome. So lever down here, grab it, and it will, it will move around and swivel. Locks back into place for safety, and you've got your armrests as well. A fully adjustable armrests, up and down, makes driving along nice and comfy, as well as having a meal at the table. <laughs> or playing cards or whatever's up your boat. Some great features inside the Fiat Ducato. Look, if you've got any more questions on some of the functionality or pairing of your mobile phones or using the SatNav, don't, don't hesitate to get in touch with Tim and the team here at Jayco Newcastle.